All right, so to consistently monitor these biomarkers, again, to keep in mind, we recommend every three to six months, which would be two or four tests a year. Um, or if you have made a pretty significant change in your routine, letting that change settle for uh, a few weeks, you can see how long we expect you um, or expect that intervention to take before you would be able to see an impact that's included in all of our recommendations. Um, so that could be if you start a new supplement. Importantly, always, 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 you wanna make sure that you're retesting in three months if you start a new supplement. Supplements are an incredibly effective way to have a direct impact on a biomarker. Um, sometimes it can be too effective. So if you're taking too much of a supplement, you wanna make sure that you're not taking that very high dose of a supplement for too long because that can start to tip the scales in the other direction. Um, on the flip side of that, again, we should expect to see some improvement in three months from that supplement and that dosage that was recommended. If you don't see any improvement in three months, then that could be an indication that the dosage may not be appropriate, might not be high enough, or you wanna make sure that you're incorporating other recommendations in addition to just taking the supplement to support improving that marker. Um, if you're amping up your exercise routine, your body's going to respond to that. Um, and seeing how those responses uh, can impact your biomarkers is again, important for helping piece together all of these different puzzle pieces that can really influence where that biomarker stands. Um, another example could be if you're making a diet change, like incorporating more fiber. Um, again, for some of those biomarkers like your LDL cholesterol or your hemoglobin A1C, if the diet change that you've made um, is be going to be effective, you should see that in three months. Um, within those three months, if those markers haven't improved where, really where you'd like them to be, that's a great indication that you have to do more than you're currently doing. Um, so maybe it's time to either increase that nutrient level a little bit more, increase that fiber a bit more, or consider adding in another nutrient that you also want to try and change that you know can impact that biomarker. 